Hello my fellow weirdos and welcome to another speed build. Now this one is a little bit different. It is another collab video. It is the cozy Christmas collab that Princess Jasmine put on. And there are a bunch of other simmers in this collab and I will try to link their info down below if I can't. Uh, now this one is a little bit different. I decided to remake a house I made a little while ago. It was my very first ever YouTube video. So before we get started, I'm going to explain what this is using my old video. Quarantine house challenge. As you can see, I did all of these houses. Unfortunately, number one did not get recorded. So I'm starting with number two, which is the cutest dog. Inside this house it has you get the cutest dog in the world endless wine and coffee except you have no toilet paper and in the sims that means no toilets my gallery id is flower f-l-o-w-u-r and now we will begin with the build uh, i begin the begin begin the begin yeah that's that's real good of me it's so cute to see how nervous i was and if you notice i have like this weird like not my voice <laughs> In the very beginning when I start talking about the quarantine challenge blah 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 it's really funny I'm gonna talk a little bit while I show you photos of the original one while I show you screenshots of the original one now the funny part is the sims walked in and started warming themselves by the fire and I was like no what are you doing and then I looked at the picture I'm like oh my god that's so cute so I left that in there so yeah this I have started building I think in March um, I started actually building with the sims I had never built before I watched some tutorial videos and I, I figured I should try building so I started you know doing a bunch of different builds and then when I did the quarantine house challenge I kind of wanted to to share this challenge with everyone I kind of wanted it to be kind of a thing that everybody did but nobody really picked up on it but that's cool the concept was to have the house and you had to do everything that the house said in the in the like rules and in this house I didn't include a toilet so they had to actually pee in a bush and there's about eight pee bushes and I had to constantly like redo the pee bushes uh, because they were so stinky all the time when I was trying to take the screenshots. So um, as you can see, this is the very first house. This is the next house. Now in the first house, I did not use any cheats whatsoever. No move objects, no sh show hidden objects, no show live edit objects. I There was a whole bunch of rules that I had for this challenge. And I really wanted to remake this house, but I wanted to have the second floor actually usable. So that's why the roof looks kind of A-framey in this second in in the house that I'm doing right now because like I said I really wanted it to be like a livable space and I had wanted it in the first the first time I did this house but I couldn't quite get it to be you know livable but then I found out where you could do like the little roof on the top and then the cutaway roofs and then you can still kind of play it you know so I did change it up a little bit in this one and also the inside is completely different I decided since this is a Christmas collab that I would do everything um blue and it's my I'll have a blue Christmas without you house I really wanted because I really like the Christmas tree that's like white with the blue decorations and then the I don't even know what it's called um you you know the hanging things <laughs> they're like wreaths but they just hang <laughs> anyway I liked those swags maybe I don't know but yeah I wanted to put those into the build I wanted to to kind of make it real pretty blue colored and then it just turned out that the house ended up the inside of the house ended up being blue and um i think i don't think i used base game only objects no i didn't use base game only objects i decided in this build the second build to use the bowling night stuff pack stones and then the island living i think it's the island living um wood slats for the the white part of the house and I, the whole time i was doing this house the, the the theme of the collab is cozy christmas collab so i was trying to do like a cozy christmas cottage and so there's fireplaces everywhere and it's kind of just like a little place you could go you could even use this as like a rental lot i tried to make it as almost like a lodge or something real cozy and there's like one tv but 
there's let's see one two three four i think fireplaces and that's the first time i used that pergola and i totally love that thing it is so pretty and see how it like stuck in the walls there i just said that would be perfect for like holding up a shelf so i put the shelf there on the the second story the loft area now in a minute once i get starting to work up in the loft i'm gonna do a really neat trick with the fireplaces which I didn't really like plan on doing but it just I saw the one fireplace from I believe it's from Snowy Escape and it just worked out perfectly so I just left it in there I'm like yep this is perfect um I'm not sure what I think that might be the jungle adventure cabinets I think that's what those are and but I really love the way they look and I did try to put the the fireplace like recessed into the wall but it looked kind of weird so i put it back out see i put those two fireplaces like that but it was just so oh no that's the downstairs never mind but the upstairs i had them like that too and i i just kind of messed around switched it up a little bit and here i'm doing the cool thing with the fireplaces so i built a wall i put the two fireplaces together and then i took the wall away and I took a stove hood thing and put it on the top and it looks really neat. I like the way it turned out, especially since it's kind of, you know, it's like the bedroom. So you can, you can have a fire and you can like just see out the windows still, you know, since there can't be any other windows because of the stupid roof. <laughs> I would have loved to add dormers, but it, you know, I wanted to keep it as close to the quarantine house meme as possible and once i added those arches i was just like wow this is just it it really fits in so i i added some more arches later you'll see and it looks really neat it kind of here they are right here um as long as my soundtrack is correct um it kind of reminds me of like a like the 70s style they always had like the fire pit and then they'd have like these arch <laughs> arches through the house and stuff and I changed up that little shelf up there to have some topiary on it because I thought you know, this looks really cute I got this huge huge living area kind of like a rec room it's got um, bookshelves it's got the fireplace it's got like a little conversation pit and the chessboard and this is the first time I've actually used um, the platform tool I've never used it I've tried using it and it just like got really like messed up so I just scrapped the whole thing but this is the first time I actually got it to work the way I wanted it to work without you know destroying the whole house but I wanted the house to be very very open because when I think of getaway cabins or cottages I just think of like open airy so yeah and then I decided to start decorating the house for Christmas starting with the lights and of course that tree maybe that is a green tree with blue anyway this is my cozy christmas collab contribution that is a lot of c's um and it's my i'll have a blue christmas cottage so i hope you enjoyed thank you for watching if you did enjoy please click the like button and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this one and if you find the bowling pin go ahead and put it down in the comments once you find it and i will see you next time thanks for watching bye guys remember to always stay weird because weirdos rule i almost forgot to say it all right talk to you later bye merry christmas and happy holidays to those who don't celebrate christmas bye